you remember that guy that I like, identified as Korean? Oh God. He was like being interviewed and this like uh, this this lady was interviewing him. I think I him. saw a, a clip of that. Yeah. If you guys don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about a guy named Ollie. And they went on a really fun trip to Korea. <laughs> <laughs> like, one time I identify as Korean came back and was like you know what I'm Korean now and then the person that was interviewing him was like it's a black not- woman it was a black woman and she was like I couldn't just like say that I'm a different race you know what yeah, I mean? yeah and, which kind of makes sense and I can't you as a as a white person have certain privileges where we don't you know and she was like you can't just like pick a race <laughs> you it's so ridiculous yeah well here's the thing I say just don't give him publicity mm-hmm. because I think it's a publicity stunt and I don't think it really matters at the end of the day if he wants to call himself Korean and live in his own fantasy world like he can. I think the black lady made a good point. She said like, it's not like I can just be like, hey, I'm white, Mm -hmm. you know? And she's like, even if I did do that, I wouldn't get all the privileges that come with being a white person. Right. 